found, but not by the police or the men who were involved in the hunt for it, but by pickles. And here we've got pickles. Come on, boy. Come on, pickles. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, pickles. Oh, pickles and pats. Come on. Stay, Pat. Now, you stay. Ah, well, this is pickles. No. Well, Pickles was sniffing away at a rather large parcel. And when Mr. Corbett picked it up, he saw a gleam of gold. I pulled the top off, and I could see the top of the statue. And I looked back at the page, and I see Brazil 62, and that's what sort of clicked in my mind. Pickles certainly won't be forgotten, because he's already got a medal. Naming him Dog Hero of 1966. There was a more substantial prize, almost £5,000 of reward money. We'd lost trace of Pickles, we didn't know if he was alive or not, and as soon as we came off the air, our phones just didn't stop ringing, with people telling us that his owner definitely was still alive and was working for the GPO at Redhill. So we were able to contact Mr Corbett there by telephone, and he told us a rather sad story, that just about three years ago, Pickles developed an extremely bad habit of chasing local cats, and uh, on one occasion, he shot after one, his lead caught on to something, and poor old Pickles actually broke his neck. It serves him right for chasing cats.